Today is a beautiful day for science. Currently we're looking at another X-class flare that occurred from region 3886. Today we actually had two of them. It was an X1.51 that originated at region 3886 at 2046 UTC. And as that uh, flux started to go down, it peaked slightly up again at 2102 with an X1.17 and then came back down. So here we are taking a look at the imagery. There is a chronomass ejection that is involved. So the uh, beautiful two X-class flares did have a chronomass ejection that's also interplanetary, meaning it will be departing and traveling through the system. <laughs> and beautifully, let's see here. Uh, I figure out where I put my... Uh, Ticketer screen here. There we go. And there we go. So beautifully we can see already on Soho imagery that this indeed is going westward. But there is a chance I do expect us to get a minor glancing impact of this from the expansion of this uh, ICME. As we can see here, westward motion with a great expansion amount, but Still, as such, I expect at the most a glancing impact. I do expect us to see a minor glancing impact. And the reason I say that is because we did get a minor plus to that proton of flux as well. And you can see that off here in the corner. So I believe we're going to see a very, very minor impact from this event. And it's we're just on that cusp of the expansion. So nothing too much to expect. Beautiful farewell from Region 3886 as it gave us two X-class flares on the rim, western rim. And, uh, of course, we always have more to look forward to as the sun continues towards its solar maximum, expected approximately the uh, July of 2025. Cheers and science on.